Hi, my name is Suzanne Doyle Ingram and I am a self-publishing mentor. I help people write and self-publish books. There goes my phone. <laughs> and I'm making this video today because um, oftentimes authors that I work with, they say to their friends and their family, oh, you know, my book's ready, it's up on Amazon. And their friends say, well, I'd really like to buy it, but I don't know how. So I thought I would make this little tutorial on how to buy a book, and especially a Kindle book, because a lot of times people think, oh, Kindle, I don't understand it, it's too complicated. It's actually really, really easy. And in this tutorial, I'm also going to show you how to read Kindle books for free and how to find free Kindle books, so it won't cost you a penny. So the first thing you're going to want to do is have a way of reading the Kindle books. Now you don't have to go out and buy a Kindle. If you have one already, that's great. But if not, you can read Kindle books for free on pretty much any device that you have. You can download the Kindle app for free from Amazon. And you can put it on your computer, on your PC or your Mac. You can read Kindle books on your phone, whether it's iPhone or Android. You can read Kindle books on your tablets, like your iPad or your other kind of tablet that's Android, that's not Apple. So I'll show you what to do. You go to Google and you're just going to, let's say I want to download the Kindle app to read Kindle books on my computer. I'm just going to write, I'm just going to Google Kindle for See, it shows you right here, you've got Kindle for PC, Kindle for Mac, Kindle for iPad. So let's say I want Kindle for PC. And it's right here, you're going to want to go to Amazon. I wouldn't go anywhere else. These two things are advertisements. Um, and you know, and if you scroll down, you might find other things like File Hippo. Don't go there, just go to Amazon. And it, it'll tell you exactly how to do it. Um, it's probably starting to download right now on my computer, which I don't really want to do since I already have it. Um, but then you just read all the instructions and, and it'll, it'll just start. And then anytime you want to read a Kindle book, you just double click on your Kindle book and it'll open right on your computer. And you can do this on your, on your iPad as well. So let's get rid of this. Um, because I already have it. So that's how you get your Kindle app. So then what we're going to want to do is go to Amazon. So you can see up the top here, I just typed in Amazon.com. If you're in Canada, you type in Amazon.ca. I am in Canada, but I prefer the .com. I usually do .com any chance I can. So uh, that's why I'm on .com. But you can do whatever you want. So now, if, you're, if you have a friend that has written, bo written a book, they'll give you a link and you can go to that book and... Um, you can buy it. So what you would do is hover over here where it says, hello, sign in your account, new customer, start here. So you're going to want to sign up as a customer with Amazon. If you've ever bought anything on Amazon, you already have an account, right? So it's very highly likely that you have an account, but if you don't have an account, just start here. So I'm going to click sign in because I already have an account and then I'm just going to be in. Okay. So they're already suggesting books to me based on you know what I'm interested in but um, what I want to do is you can search up here so you can search for anything that you're interested in um, if your friend if you know their name or the title of their book you can type it in up here so I'm going to type in um, my friend's name that just wrote a book Karen D Webb Oops, and you can see it's in in all departments in Kindle store or books and her book is a Kindle book so I'll click here she is a teacher at my children's school and uh, um, she's written this book called 12 tips to ensure a successful school year written by a 36 year teaching veteran so I would click on here and then it has the price um, tells you a little bit about it you can look inside if you click on here to see if you like it or not and it has another window that pops up and tells you all about it you can see the table of contents and that kind of thing you go up here and click close when you're finished looking at it um, and then you can just buy it here now I've got it set up so it delivers to my iPad right away but you might like look at that it'll go to my iPhone my Kindle cloud reader Kindle for PC wherever I want it to go and you can do the same so you just click now click buy now with one click or give as a gift if I've already bought it so uh, I'm not gonna click 
by now. But that's what you do. You just click and then it'll give you options to begin reading it right away. It's very easy. So that's how you buy a book that someone's recommended to you on Amazon. And I also would recommend that if it's a friend of yours and you like the book, or even if you don't like the book, you write a review. So you just click on here, write a customer review, and it will already it will already um, pop up and you can give it five store, five stars, or two or three, if if it's if you like it you should give five because it'll really help with book sales and then uh, you write your review and that'll be that'll be helpful so now going back to the I'm going to show you how to get free books now okay so if you click on shop by department you end up getting this hodgepodge of stuff right so you don't want to do that you want what you want to do is just hover without clicking and you'll see unlimited instant videos, digital music, etc. and so on. You go all the way down to right underneath this fine line here you see books and audible and still hovering without clicking you go over and then up here to Kindle books and click on that. They make it a little bit difficult to find free Kindle books so this is the best way to do it. Okay, Then you want to scroll down the page until you get to Kindle bestsellers and click on that. Now here the ones they're showing us are the top free or sorry top 100 top 100 paid Kindle books. You can scroll down and see them all but at the very beside it here at the top it says top 100 free so you can click on that and find free Kindle books. So let's say that I find one that I like. I was uh, I clicked on um, this mermaid book, um, this one, Everblue. I just clicked on that because I was testing this out before I made this video. So let's say I want this, and it says here Kindle price 000. Okay, so let's say I want to buy this, so I click on buy now with one click. And then it says, thanks Suzanne, your item will be sent to Suzanne's iPad. And Kindle for iPad will st start downloading this item the next time you open the application. So that's it. That's all you need to do. If I wanted to start reading this, I would just go onto my iPad and start reading it. It's very, very simple to do once you have a little bit of help figuring it all out. So I hope you found this video to be helpful. If so, you can leave a comment below, that would be great, or click the like button, and um, if you have any interest in writing a book, be sure you reach out to me, I'd love to help you. Take care, thank you.